Uh, so uh, we will uh, say in this final area we say that the color will be white and we have height of around 700 pixel and we have in the final area we have some image which is here and uh, we must say that we have the background uh, URL and in the images we have uh, some background no repeat and the center then we have in this images we have the same image which is here let's copy and paste it here let's save and refresh nothing happened so let's refresh and uh, save the refresh another time I think uh, final area which is here We can start something, I will say that we have div here and uh, wrapping another div here and after that uh, we have to say that we have a class footer and this will be a footer a color to white, uh, let's say black for now Alright, and uh, we want this background to be shown, uh, but we say uh, we have in the images. So uh, we will go back here and let's refresh. So a uh, background size to be covered. After uh, that, uh, let's uh, refresh and I think height is large, so 500 pixel and uh, text align to be center, color to be uh, back to white and after that in the footer area we have uh, some tiny images which is tiny uh, image and uh, we will uh, make this class to be uh, width of 5% let's try it again and uh, in this footer h3 and uh, I will say that padding top uh, maybe 10 pixel 0 10 big uh, I think uh, 0 or 5 pixel let's see what we have and in the paragraph we can say it's which is here we can delete it and refresh so uh, we uh, will say in the paragraph we have maximum 
width of uh, 60 percent and after that uh, we have in this paragraph margin to be uh, around 3 em and what let's see, see what we have i think it much better for me but let's say it will be 1 em and uh, let's say it, if we, it will be zero so so the problem was uh, is with these images so we have this tiny images tiny image and uh, if we say that the size or the width 100 pixel let's see what we have maybe a width of uh, so the problem uh, was uh, that we have we haven't selected the right uh, class so I have uh, chosen this right class tiny image and uh, I have added some padding which is here and uh, reduce the size but if we uh, make I think we have uh, finished the uh, same side, but I think we uh, want to make uh, some adjustment. Uh, I want to make uh, these images to be extending full uh, width uh, to this, uh, but uh, let's see how we can make it. Uh, so because we have uh, the wrapper or the container uh, have the div, so it this div will be like this but if we make the container so let's uh, close it to be here and let's refresh again so it's now uh, wrapped nicely and you have the image full width and how we can uh, change the size so the width the height will be let's say seven like this and I think now we have finished the site so I hope you enjoy this uh, mini tutorial or mini series about uh, this mini framework which is skeleton I hope you enjoy this course so you see you in any uh, course in my youtube channel